I think I fell in love with Porsche originally when I think I was reading about a 993 GT2 RS in Performance Car Magazine and um, just saw that car and it was, it was a black car. I remember reading that article back and forth, back and forth, word for word. I memorised it all over um, and it won the test. It was against um, a Ferrari 355 and um, so I just poured over Porsches ever since then. Never thinking, genuinely never thinking I'd be able to afford and own one. I'm from quite humble beginnings, um, so I thought it would never ever happen for me. Um, and then just the opportunity came up, so the, the first chance I had to buy an actual sports car, it was a Porsche. Tried a M4, liked the M4, the performance was fantastic, but the feel, sound and handling of the Porsche was just incredible. Um, and haven't looked back since. So I went from there, went on to a GT4, and now onto the GT3, which was just unbelievable. So two years, 15,000 miles, a couple of huge European road trips, went to Le Mans last year, went to Geneva Motor Show. So was, do you want to fly there? No, I'm going to drive. Um, and then it's done so many track days since as well. And it's just, that, that for me is what that car is all about. You can drive it across Europe in one stint. I did Geneva Motor Show, back to Cheltenham in 14 hours one hit um, in the bucket seats um, and yet you can take it around the track drive it around track hit it as hard as you can and then just drive home again like i'm not i don't know of another brand that you can do that where it's built to that standard where the car just feels better the harder you drive it Um, and everyone always comes up to me and says, oh my God, your car sounds amazing. What exhaust has it got on it? It's just a stock exhaust. Because the car gets driven hard and driven properly, it sounds incredible out of the box. It's more than just the car. So it's the whole family and community that come with it. Everyone's so welcoming. Um, I think from the outset, because I'm not from rich beginnings, I assumed that everyone was going to be really arrogant and standoffish and not welcome you in, but the reverse is true. For me, looking outside in, it looks like other brands might be a bit more like that, whereas Porsche is just so welcoming, it's just part of that big family and community. The livery, this is the second set um, of livery that's on the car. Um, we're currently designing the third set. It's something that we just got into because when I was going over to Geneva last year, we were trying to source livery because we're going up with, what do we want to do with the car, make it look interesting for the uh, road trip over to Geneva. And um, we wanted to do the Salzburg livery, but we came across a guy online that did the livery. So now I'm working closely with that guy and we're now doing just Porsche livery. So we've got bespoke cuts like made specifically for cars uh, all across the Porsche range. Um, and you can have anything off the shelf or even just come up with your own creative design. And a bit like a tattoo, we will send it back to you to say, is this what you want? Do you want to make any changes? You can have any color or shape or anything that you want. Do you realize Porsche would inspire your, not only personal life, but also your business life as much? No, and the fact that you can combine everything in one is just, yeah, it's a dream come true, to be honest.